Okay, guys, we went from bad news to a little bit worse news. And as you can see, the fourth trans female has been attacked and killed this year. All trans females, all in the black community. Now, this, this woman is unique because she was the individual who went viral for getting a beatdown about a month ago. Her name is Malaysia Booker, as you can see in the title. She survived that attack, but somebody just got her over the weekend and shot her in the back, it seems, like a coward. Just like the fucking cowards who ganged up on her to beat her down because of her identity. Guys, we gotta stop. We have to stop dividing each other along gender identity lines, sexual preference, religion, race, ethnicity. Why do we have to keep repeating this in 20 fucking 19? We knew in the beginning as humans that there were folks at the top that would do anything they could to divide us, pitting us against each other for money, for prestige, for identity reasons. And now it's, it's, it's 2019 and we're still attacking each other based on tribalistic reasons. Oh, they're the other. Oh, that, that person, they're trans. They're not, they're not human enough. We got to fucking snuff them out or a gay person or an atheist person or black or brown or native. Now, these attacks have been going on in the black community. And there is a strand of fragile masculinity in the black community that leads to a lot of attacks like this on gay and trans folks. And you men in the black community have got to get that under control. You cannot rely on women to fuck carry the mantle for you on this one, buddy. I know they do politically. Don't fucking tell me I'm wagging my finger. I am wagging my... I know I'm wagging my finger. I'm pointing it at motherfuckers. I'll point it at anyone who's doing the wrong thing. This fucking country is transphobic. And we see it in the president who kicked him out of the military. And we are seeing it in the black community who's killing trans women. And we see it amongst white Christians who preach love until someone needs to use the fucking bathroom. How about you mind your own damn business and let people use the bathroom? Fucking ridiculous. You need to be worrying about male violence. That's what you need to be worrying about. Straight male violence. Towards the queer community, trans community, communities of other colors. For fucking money, against women, against children, animals. It's a male violence issue. And I got something for every one of you, fuck, one of your communities. Every community I got something for. White, black, brown, native, I got something for every one of you motherfuckers. Because this shit has got to end now. We cannot move forward if we're chopping off each other's freaking limbs, cutting each other down, taking each other's life. What the fuck are we doing going after trans people? The smallest, most vulnerable minority in the country. You're fucking going after trans... We're going after trans people? You want to go after a minority? Go after the 1%, tough guys. You who fucking shot her. You who beat her down. Go after the top 1%. Get politically active. Be a real fucking man. Nah, you can't do that. You had to beat down a trans woman like a fucking coward. Hop in the ring with a guy like me, see what's up. You don't fucking play that shit with me. I'll beat you down. I'll put you where your fucking place is. And you know that's right. You know that's motherfucking right. And that's all I got on that one. May she rest in power.